This week on Vancouver Real, we have registered psychologist Dr. Kasim Al Mashat. And that for me is also the connection of humanity. Yes. Because we all have our own story and we feel we're very unique. And we are unique, but there's commonality in all of us. And Absolutely. Common human experience. And we all have a story of pain and suffering and a story of joy but we feel disconnected. So we have that negativity bias and um, Dr. Rick Hansen actually says it beautifully, uh, a neuropsychologist, he says, our brain latches on to negatives like Velcro, uh, brain. So when we're caught in the me, why is this happening to me? I can't believe this is happening. The story of, you know, the story of me. We are not in the experiential network, so we are lost in thoughts. And the wandering mind just gets triggered, spins. Mm -hmm. Mindfulness actually activates this other part, the, uh, the neural pathways that are related to experience, sensations. So if you've done the past now or any form of meditation or even float here, you become more aware of sensations. Yes. That's the experiential network cool. in the brain. Some interesting research is happening on epigenetics and they're looking at meditation, mindfulness, mindfulness meditation particularly, and the effect it has on the telomeres on, uh, on the chromosome, the endochromosome, and how actually stress degenerates it quickly. It's the protective cap wow. at the end of a chromosome. So. Uh, They've noticed actually of, of meditation is you slow down the degeneration of those chromosomes, the telomeres, right. the ends, which means more longevity. Yeah. So I think we all intuit there's something that we need to do to work with these demands of daily life that has become just, you know, the, the rat race life and no time to think, no time to stop and breathe. And the shift that they've created now, and, and it's booming in the States, is they're calling it participatory medicine. It's a new paradigm of medicine, because how do you participate in your own healing? Mm -hmm. Cool. Instead of just going to someone and saying, fix me, participatory medicine, you take charge of your well-being. And yes, include your doctors and your professionals. But what are you doing outside that time with them?